Am I the only one who's like unnaturally obsessed with the TanaCon series that's going on on Shane Dawson's channel right now? Because like the third part and the final part comes out today and I'm like just a little more excited than I should be. Hey guys! So today I'm going to be doing a video I haven't done in a while and that is a haul and I may or may not have spent like about $500. Um, anyway, this is a collective haul. I did not buy all of this at one time because that's a little insane. Just, just a little crazy. I bought this over a period of, I want to say, four to six months. Can't remember exactly, but I know I didn't buy this all in one day or one month. And most of the stuff I have, I got on Amazon because Amazon Prime is actually the best thing to be ever created. So we're just going to get into the haul because you guys want to see what I bought. You don't want to see me talk. So let's get started. <laughs> So if you follow me on Instagram, I already did like an Insta story, so like you should follow me on Instagram. Like why aren't you following me on Instagram? But I did a thing with Mix Easy. So Mix Easy is a brand which I'm going to explain because they sent me this stuff for free. They reached out to me and they're like, hey, do you wanna make a video about our products and like show it off to your viewers and we'll give you a discount code? And I was like, hells yes. Am I allowed to? Am I allowed to say hell? Frick yeah! Mix Easy is a brand where you basically go on their website and you customize your skincare. Um, they have face wash, face cream, shampoo, and conditioner, and I think that's all they have for right now. I basically chose a shampoo, a conditioner, and a face cream. I quickly run through um, like the special ingredients. The face cream, my key ingredients are Arnica extract, Propolis extract, rosehip extract, damask rose flower extract, daisy flower extract, and cranberry extract. And then for the shampoo, I got it for dry hair because I have curly hair, therefore my hair is dry. I got it in the scent honey and milk. I got the face cream and bamboo and cucumber, and it's a really refreshing scent, but they also have no scent. So if you're like very sensitive to scents, you don't have to worry. The shampoo, I named it Sweet Like Honey, <laughs> and I have Echinacea extract? Echinacea. Probably pronounced that wrong. Achillea extract, propolis extract, ginseng extract, dragon's blood extract, and argan oil. And then for the conditioner, which I named Hydration, Hydration Station, I had Echinacea extract, Achilla extract, dragon's blood extract, hyaluronic acid, amino acids, and jojoba oil. If you guys want to try out their products, I have a discount code for 20% off, I'm pretty sure, and it's on the screen. It is FOREST in all caps. It will be in the description box. Anyway, now to the stuff I actually got. <laughs> So first thing I got was, I got this a while ago, but it's the Real Technique sponge because the girl's too broke to buy the Beauty Blender. It came in this little case, which is really good because like it's hygienic and it's not just sitting on your dirty counter, like you can put it in its case. Then I got the Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray. Literally everyone and their mothers has tried this and I really like it. Like I've tried this maybe five times at this point and it's time to get the eight fluid ounce one. So, the eight fluid one ounce one, and I love it. The other two things I got from Ulta were like travel size stuff. So I got the Too Faced Hangover RX Primer, and I can say that I really like it. You might want to be careful about this if you're like allergic to coconuts or you have sensitive skin because there is coconut water in it. And then I got the Mario Bades Mario Badescu <laughs> Urban Decay All Nighter Long Lasting Spray. And not gonna lie, I got this because Ava Jules talked about it in her vlogmas like, two years ago. Used it a lot and I was like, okay, I'll get it. So I got the travel size and I think I'm just gonna get the travel size until I die because I can't rationalize spending like 20 or $30 on a setting spray. So my dad went back home to Kenya for like a month and I asked him if he could buy me some foundation. 
bib and he got it from Black Opal and he got me concealer as well. So from Black Opal, I got the True Color Pore Perfecting Liquid. <laughs> and I got two of them because I did not trust them having something that was exactly my skin tone. But I got it in Au Chocolat and Carob or Carob, I don't know how you pronounce it. And then I also got concealer and I got the Black Opal. I don't know what type of concealer, what concealer this is. I asked him to give me the liquid one and he got me the stick one and it's in the shade Toast. So I got these brushes because the brushes I had been using I had for maybe six or seven years and they were like really old and I just needed new brushes. So I got the BS Small like brushes. They just look like this. They're like rose gold top black. Look very sleek. They're very soft. And I've had these for maybe two months at this point. And they haven't shed, but I haven't washed them yet. The next two things are skincare. So I love Korean like beauty and skincare. I got the Secret Key Lemon Sparkling Peeling Gel because I like the peeling gels for exfoliators more than like the grainy exfoliators. I don't know, those just hurt my skin and I feel like they do more harm than they do good. Then I got the Innisfree Bija Trouble Facial Foam. And honestly, it's been doing its job. It cleans my skin and like I can feel my skin getting clean, which is really nice. I got this, Ugh, it's so hard to like show. Um, It's a romper and I don't have rompers. Like this is my first ever romper, guys. It has a crochet like lace top with like a floral bottom as you can see and then there's like ties in the back. It's really cute. I wore it to my friend's 18th birthday dinner. I think I got it from Romwe or Shein. I saw it on Dope and I'm, I'm on Dope so like if you want to follow me you can but like Dope doesn't know who I am so <laughs> I have this bag that I ordered off of Amazon. It's like a no brand name bag. It's got this plain like crossbody um, gold chain bag and you can take off the chains and make it like a clutch. I need to stop. I don't know why I do this literally all the time. Maybe I should learn sign language so like I'm actually using my hands usefully. Then I got swimsuits because my friend, the same one where I went to her birthday dinner, she had a pool party and I needed swimsuits. So I got two swimsuits. So I got this one from Uniqlo. I didn't personally get it. My mom was in Boston. She was like, hey, you wanted a swimsuit, right? And I was like, yeah. And then she got me this. It's a black triangle top with like white around it. I don't know why I'm explaining it, but the back is like, I just like how like it closes. It feels more secure. You know, I feel secure in that. And then the bottoms just look one second as I try and get my life together. <laughs> a matching set, obviously. It has ties on the side and ties have always given me anxiety because I'm just like, what if one of them goes undone? Like you're just gonna like expose yourself to everyone at the pool. Then I got another bikini, which I actually wore to her party and it's from Cupshe. And I've heard like mixed reviews about Cupshe. So I ordered it off of Amazon from Prime because I needed this to get to me in less than a week. But, so the top is going to be a struggle to explain, but I will try my best. So there's padding, which I need because my nipples like to show themselves to the world and I'm like not a big fan of that. You put your arms in like this and then you put it over your breastuses. And then you, there's another one on the other side obviously and you kind of just wrap it around yourself. I'm not explaining this well at all. And then the bottoms are very simple, same design. I felt more secure in these bottoms because like it's really hard to expose yourself in these bottoms. So the first thing I'm going to show you are like cases. So I finally got a case for my laptop because like not having a case on my laptop was kind of stressing me out, not gonna lie. So I got this marble, um, blue marble case and I just really like it and it just makes my laptop look cute. Continue the marble theme. I got this phone case. It's marble, but I think of it more as like icebergs. Looks more like icebergs. I don't know. I'm weird. But we already knew this, so. I got 
um, a portable charger because my phone, it's old and like the battery is spoiled. Charge doesn't last that long on my phone. I'm that annoying friend who's always asking like if there's an outlet or if anyone has a charger or like a portable charger because my phone dies very fast. I break chargers. Like, I'm not someone who loses, like, wires. I just break them. So I got an extra, like, iPhone charger cord just in case the cord I'm using right now breaks because it inevitably will, knowing me. So I just have a backup on hand. There are four things left. We're almost done. So next, I got a water bottle and I got a hydro flask because I drink a lot of water and... The water bottle I had from Victoria's Secret Pink, like, it did the job, but I didn't have enough water. This is a 21 ounce bottle. And I got yellow, cause like, yellow's like been my favorite color recently. I don't care what anyone says. Yellow is beautiful, beautiful. Yellow is a beautiful color, okay? Then I got a Instax Mini 9, cause I've been wanting a Polaroid like Instax like camera for so freaking long it's not even funny I have four photos left in this um film so obviously I had to get film so I bought film and I have another 10 pack and my goal for the summer if you watched my summer bucket list video you know but if you haven't how dare you and you should watch it after this video my I, my plan was to take more memorable pictures and the last thing I got was something I've been wanting for a while and I kind of just finally like gave in and bought it myself and it's milk and honey by Rupi Kaur I remember when this was like the thing everyone was getting for Christmas back in like what I don't know 2015 2016 the first couple of poems I was just like whoa <laughs> that's a lot to take in just right then but I really I enjoy how she does her poems why is V posting so much what is that V or is that is it different members or is it just V it's V. What the? What is he doing? I'm so confused. So if you guys enjoyed that haul, remember that I have a 20% off code from Mix Easy in the description box. So if you want to buy some of their products, you can do it for 20% off because I got you. Comment down below one thing that you recently purchased. A random thing that you just bought because you wanted to buy it. Remember, I do K-pop regularly. How does it go? Remember, I do K-pop, KB, regular beauty, fashion, K-pop. I do K-pop, KB, regular beauty, fashion, K. I do KB, regular beauty. Oh my gosh, I'm actually stupid. Wow. I do KB, regular beauty, fashion, K-pop, and random videos. So if you enjoyed those types of videos, please hit the subscribe button down below and also hit that little bell button next to the subscribe button so you can be notified every single time I upload a video and can probably become part of Notification Squad. Remember that somebody loves you and I will see you guys in my next video.